I was gonna make some eggs, but I literally put the butter in the pan to get ready to do the eggs and I opened the fridge. Eggs are finished. So we're just having guac toast. That's that. It's so good. The eggs would have made it 10 times better. Daddy, he making me thicker. Rob is hard, bitches a sticker. I can't be falling in love with a nigga. Pockets were small, they got bigger. You did me wrong, what I do? Acting a smoochie when I'm off the liquor. Showing my thong, going cool. Throwing it back and I watch him get bigger. Daddy, he making me thicker. Rob is hard. Hey y'all, I'm really outside. I hope y'all can hear me, but I got my acai bowl. Y'all, by the way, go to your nearest Publix. Like, they have acai bowls now. The small one is $5.99, the big one is $7.99. So I only paid $8 for this. This is the big one. And um, I got two spoons just in case because the clumsiness in me will probably drop one of them. So I got an extra one. So I'm gonna be out here by myself. I've been doing this uh, quite a couple times. I usually go to the gym first and then come out here and, you know, chill and just relax a bit. I really enjoy this because a lot of times, like, you know, my friends are either out of town or my, my friends are still at school um my other friends are still in high school so they don't have like like fake they're not like on summer vacation like how i am like i'm able to do anything at any time like today's monday and it's 12 o'clock like all my other friends are literally at school or whatever the case may be but i'm out like go to the gym by myself like i've been doing everything by myself i just haven't been documenting it as much and i want to start doing that um i know i've been in my own youtube it's a long story i do want to do a little life update i mean it's not even a story it's just that sometimes you just have those moments where you're just like tired you know so that was just kind of one of those moments for me. Y'all see how good that looks? Oh my gosh. It looks so freaking good. Not so much on my nails. Um, That's another story for after. Nah, but it's not even a story, y'all, for real. My nails just popped up like a couple days ago. And my nail tech, she's not in town. But y'all, to be honest, where I've been, I've just been really in my own zone. Learning more about myself. Getting closer to God. You know, exploring my faith and stuff. And just like, doing all these good things. I've been up to a lot of good things. I have this big, 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 big project that has, that's coming this year at the end of the year y'all know i'm back in town from school so i'm trying to do hair you know stack up rack up be on my you know hot girl stuff like one thing about me if i don't have friends to do it i'm gonna go do it alone like i'm just one of those people and look how good this spoon looks y'all full of fruits it's just so good but y'all one thing about me if i ain't got no friends to do it i'm gonna go and do it by myself that's one thing about me a lot of random people be walking by and i just be like <laughs> my bitch way <laughs> but y'all I'm very excited for this new chapter of my life. It's a crazy chapter, but I feel like it's gonna be a really, really good one. Maybe like a whole bunch of nice boats driving by, and I can't wait to be on one. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know that TikTok, it was like, I've been suffering for 19 years, it's time to shake my ass on a yacht. Like, I need to shake my ass on a you know what I mean? And y'all, ever since like YouTube ain't been the same, it just, I don't know, like, I don't really know how to explain that it's not been the same, but it just hasn't been the same. I know a lot of people probably like understand what I'm saying. Some people might not, and that's fine. But like YouTube just ain't been the same. Like the YouTube that I that I knew when I started four years ago is just not the same right now. It kind of sucks because it's kind of like discouraging in a sense. So I've been trying to like you know push through with that, but I don't know. It's just like it don't feel the same. I've been trying to put out content, like it just don't feel the same. Not that I'm home, like. I don't even know what type of content to post anymore because usually when I was at college, I was posting college life, you know, content. But now I'm home and I'm just, but you know, y'all know I do hair and stuff like that. So I might just, you know, do a couple of days in life with a hairstylist, you know, do solo diaries like this one, do stuff like that. I'm gonna try to step out my comfort zone more and do more stuff. But sometimes I just like don't be knowing y'all. Like I really don't be knowing. I need you, yeah, I really do. Tell me what to do. Okay. Tell me what to do. Okay. Tell me what to do. All I know is hit the mall to see what damage I could do. Okay. Down, I think about you all day, mommy I know I'm a pit bull, but darling, mommy I just wanna take you on a holiday, mommy Say what's on your mind, I'ma call away, mommy Come and rescue me Whoa. Take me out the club, take me out the trap Take me off the mark, take me off the map I'm tryna hit the group chat and tell them it's a come and rescue me Take me out the club, take me out the trap, take me off the market, take me off the map. I'm trying to 
tryna hit the group chat and tell them it's all I don't really know how to confess my love Really seem like I wanna test my love For you who don't know how to express my love Hey y'all, sorry to interrupt today's video. However, today's video is actually sponsored by Dossier. Dossier came clutch and did it again. They sent me four amazing fragrances. Here they are right here. They actually have a different colored box. Very impressed. I'm loving it, Dossier. I love the switch up. But let me tell you about these fragrances that I got. The first one that I got in the mail is Caramelized Lavender and Hazelnut. By the way, this time around, these fragrances might sound like what in the world to y'all. But um, I really wanted to step out of my comfort zone when it comes to these because I just wanted to switch it up and do something different because I've been working with Dossier for a little while. While now and it's always been a pleasure but I always feel like I kind of catch myself always getting the same exact fragrances so I decided to try something new here's the first one that your girl got and let me say this smell like exactly like the name I mean like oh my gosh like I'd be putting this before I go to sleep and I would smell myself in the covers like it's just listen hear me out like spray some dossier before you go to bed you will smell yourself all night and it smells amazing and like everyone always give me a compliment on how I smell and listen thanks to dossier <laughs> then in the next step we're gonna go to the beige box um this one is aquatic coconut and this one is actually inspired by a beach wall by mason margiela this thing right here gives me like a super fresh vibe like a really beachy you know like fresh scent fresh out the shower like that's exactly what it gives and it's a very light scent as well but it smells literally amazing and of course let's not forget about the package when it comes to dossier i mean like Let's talk about it. Like, package is super minimalistic, but it is literally the best. Now, next up, what we have is this strong scent. This is, I don't want to, I don't know if this was in the men's section. I don't think so. But however, like this fragrance right here is just the bomb, but it's also very strong. So if you're not into strong scents, you might not like this one. But what I like about this kind of scent is that when you get a strong scent, you can mix it up with the light scent, like the aquatic coconut, and it smells so bomb. So boom. This next one is called Fiery Leather and Rube. But here it is. I'm surprised the um color is like this color. I was expecting a darker color. And it says that it's made like the goal was to get like raw materials, floral, vegan, black leather accord and rhubarb. So you gotta get the vibe when it comes to a fragrance. Like with the with the perfume from Dossier, you don't just get a perfume, you get a vibe, you get a scent, you get like listen you get something from it and it's just it's bomb and the last one i got is spicy orchid i literally went for spicy strong again switching it up you know trying new things this is what it looks like this one is actually the color that i was expecting the rhubarb to be yeah smells so good packaging in the bottle of course and it has like this magnetic um kind of you see like it just kind of like gets on there real quick real easy and then so yeah these are all my fragrances from dossier literally love all of them y'all i wish i was really kidding i must say dossier is probably the number one brand that i've been working with so far like their company their website everything is just top notch and if you didn't know so much about dossier they actually are a perfume company who make mostly replicas of other perfumes that are super expensive for a cheaper price so if you want to you know ball on the budget baby dossier is the way to go you can go out there smelling like money okay that's it for this integration you guys thank you so much dossier for sponsoring today's video also you can use my coupon code i'll leave it right here and also down in the description box and also the link to these if you want to check them out in their website love you guys let's get back to the video hey y'all so I just got dressed and everything. I did my hair. I really need to reach this like real bad. Like I went back black, right? And I still got like brown roots. Not roots, but like some spots I get that I missed. But whatever. Right now we're getting ready to go to Trent Joe's. The volleyball game last night. It was so fun. Yeah, see that's why I got this like neon thing on my wrist still. It was fun. My friend he lost, so that was kind of sad. It's like 12 o'clock right now. My mom and I are getting ready to go to Costco, Trader Joe's, and get some food. So that's the plan. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me i've been using aquaphor on my spine tattoo y'all and it's been like so good because it doesn't itch as much anymore like so that's been like real good but yeah um so i'm just moisturizing a little bit i just got on like some gray biker shorts with this top and my bubble slides i need to put on a fit for real like i don't know no point really i want to go to trader joe's so bad because i've been seeing all the girlies on tiktok and everything going to trader joe's and i'm like i want to even try because i feel like when i go to college i'm only gonna shop from trader joe's because i have a kitchen now in my new dorm so i'm gonna be cooking all the time now i'm just so excited i'm gonna buy some perfume because i haven't yet this is a kimberly sweet peach y'all won't believe where i got this from it smells so good i got it for five below for five bucks yeah so for all my girlies on the budget baby <laughs> go and get this i couldn't open it because like i got lotion on my hands but yeah 
it smells so good like it smells just like peach like i don't know it's so like so fresh and stuff but yeah right now we're gonna go to trader joe's or i don't even know where we're going just gonna run some errands i'm just gonna take out with me in the midst of vlogging again i just put some black girls on screen if y'all see i look a little shiny because y'all know i ain't going outside with no sunscreen it's too hot in miami it's too sunny all that but yeah let me get my purse and we out here don't know how to express my love That's why I'm American and spray yeah, 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 yeah. Here's my love for you I need you, yeah, I really do Tell me what to do Tell me what to do okay. Tell me what to do All I know is hit the mall And see what damage I could do okay. I give you the world But there's other planets too And I need someone to be patient with me Someone to get money when I take it from me But they don't even need to be as famous as me I don't think I meet them at the places I be But deep down I think about you all day, mommy I know I'm a pit bull, but darling, mommy I just wanna take you on a holiday, mommy Say what's on your mind, I'ma call away, mommy Come and rescue me, Take me out the club, take me out the trap, take me off the market, take me off the map. I'm trying to hit the group chat and tell them it's a calm and rescue me. Take me out the club, take me out the trap, take me off the market, take me off the map. Our Costco right now, y'all, when I was buying this trap on, I did not think about like how big you do. You have macarons, that looks so good, but I did not think about like how much people that we're gonna be staring. Oh, this is mango salad. They got a whole bunch of stuff here. Anyways, my trip to Trader Joe's is great. I'm gonna give y'all a haul when I get home. We're back from Trader Joe's and Costco and everything. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Trader Joe's. So first, I had to get the lemonade. I hope this tastes good. I'm actually gonna try it right now. I'm gonna give it a try because I've been seeing a lot of people talk about this fresh squeezed lemon juice. So, gotta give it a try. Alright. Oh, she ate that. Then I, I got some raw kumbacha. And I also got this one. I've tried this one before, so I decided to get another one. We got some organic um, lemons. I got these flour tortillas because I've got the. Um, I bought the burritos stuff, which I'll show you guys in a minute. Then I got the apple smoked bacon. I also got these chicken steamed soup dumplings. We saw a lady while we were in there. She said, me good. So hopefully they do taste good. Then we got these English peas. Of course, we got some olives. Then I got the main thing that I went for. I was worried because I heard a lot of people said that they were running out of them in their stores nearby. But thankfully I was able to find it in mines. The beef burrito is going to be so good. I can't wait to do this. And then I'm going to do it with these tacos. That should be good. Let's see, that'll be like a little cooking vlog-ish. And then, of course, one of my favorite fruits, watermelon. The juice, y'all. Go get this. It's so good. Love yours. and the success hear my words and listen to my signal of distress i grew up in the city and know sometimes we had less compared to some of my niggas down the block man we were blessed and life can't be no fairy tale no once upon a time but i'll be goddamn if a nigga don't be trying so tell me mama please why you be drinking all the time
Hey y'all, welcome back to the vlog. We in the Red Cedars today with Bryant, Turbo Benz, Gang Gang. And so we about to go to Midtown, see what the vibes are like. It's 13 right now. Really need my nails done. I might get them done this weekend, cause, baby. We need them done. Oh. Oh. I miss you for a chain and give it to a sweet one called that Maya Jama. Giving out gifts like Santa, sipping on Santa. I used to do lean and wop. Closet full up with designer, coming like Panda Panda. Yeah, gal just came to the booth and asked for a will. She never heard till in Atlanta. Every thing told me that I look like Yusuf, look like Hamza. A beauty, please. Anna Akid, in Tijuana, Akhla. With pop skull in Gaza, but not that Gaza, but still it's a Maza. Niggas want peace like a Saba, but we let bridge them burn like Grava. Why? Four in the clears and one in the heady. Hand no shake, man, hold that steady. Man, love pulls with a dick for the picture. You man should've bust that thing already. Man, love hezzy, hezzy. Yeah, cat back chat to the prezzy. You know when the beat just tastes like veggie. Gal go risk for the manny petty. CC bag look nice, but the Birkin bag look way more heavy. That's just a big gal thing, man, you get me. Rainy just turned mummy, and that's my sis, so I just turned up here. Fat male came to the crib from a youth that loves me. I swear that touched me. I never even drive no whips I own, so they all look way too dusty. If me and gal is both St. Michael, the gal come way too fussy, crushy. Man said they would do this and that, but the man wasn't really that wassy, was he? Nah, 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 the man wasn't ready that wassy. So y'all, we at Target because Brian needed air tag. Um, I did not know they had an Ulta inside of Target. <laughs> we love Miami, okay? So right now we're looking for the electronics section so we can get what we need. Oh my God. Uh oh, TD or whatever. I've been blowing through the money like you blowing trees. I've been f on a French, say la vie. I just put them on a jet, now they all Italian. Way I'm dressed until I've been to a thousand dollars. This is fly by getting shots, but she's still a stallion. She don't even get the joke, but she's still smiling. Every night, late night, like I'm Jimmy Fallon. Call the from anywhere, like you ready on. Cody, turn me up. Cody, turn me up. Cody, turn me up. Got a fur on the table, got the fur on the table. Somebody open the tank. We just left Target, y'all. They were tripping about us recording and stuff. Like, they was like, oh, um, all kind of stuff. Like, I don't know. Yeah. What the hell? The People were complaining about the recording. I'm like, yeah, whatever. Anyway, y'all. Y'all know how I've been obsessed with my matcha tea latte from Starbucks. So I decided to buy the stuff and make it on my own. Every time I've been home, I've been like in the kitchen more cooking and trying new stuff. So I've been loving that for me. And I got the powdered matcha. And I got the caramel drizzle. And I also got some whipped cream to top it all off. So maybe today, later on today or tomorrow, I'm going to give it a try and see what it's talking about. And I've just been, you know, cooking and whipping it up in the kitchen. Period. Yeah, because really, you know, I'm going to get my kitchen next mess in my apartment. So... I gotta learn how to whoop it up. But yeah, Brian is here setting up his air tag. It's 3.45 now. Y'all see the time right here. And we're just out, you know, chilling, enjoying the time here. It's really hot. And it's also like, kind of like, it was supposed to rain, but I don't know if it's gonna still rain. Miami weather's so bipolar, so I ain't no telling what could happen. But yeah. All right, hey y'all. Not too much on the mess that's going on in the background, but I'm coming to give you guys a call because I got some new shoes in the mail. Got some new balances. Got some fives. No, I think these are fours, not fives. And I also got some, ooh, right here. Some Balenciaga. Okay, so these are all the shoes that I got in the mirror recently, so I'm gonna give you guys a little haul or whatever. I'm gonna do the new balances first. I actually got two in the mail. I got a good quality one and a bad quality one, so I wanna show you guys like the difference. First of all, you couldn't even tell the difference with the box. So with this box, if you kinda like try to put a dip through it, the quality of the box is just so much better, a lot more firm. Compared to this box, as you guys can see, it's already a crease in it. So you see like, it's already a dip. So with the box, you can even tell with the quality. And the real ones, the box is like a dark gray, and then the fake ones, it's like a light gray. So you could really tell the difference. So this is kind of how they look just super plain they're obviously plastic wrapped over it but you know i kind of removed that but this is what they look like you can tell the quality is kind of like so like horrible you see what i'm saying the quality is not all the way there you know they just look you can just tell right off the bat the minute you open the shoe like look at this not really given you know what i'm saying not it. so they it was just really bad quality but when you order the good quality ones you get this you get you see it's not as squishy and going in you get the good quality ones you could see the quality y'all and i've been wearing these um a few times they look so good i love these shoes y'all they're so comfortable but i always wear these these are probably like my favorite shoes in my closet yeah so i'm gonna put all the information to these shoes 
on the screen down in the description box if i have a coupon code i'll also leave all that for y'all but look how great the quality looks y'all it's super bomb like i love it and they're so comfortable like y'all i've been wanting some new alices for a while and i really wanted the gray ones but when i seen these i was like it's the perfect purplish pinkish color and i was like i gotta get it so eventually when i got it i love it y'all yeah, it's so cute like and these are really really rare to find like it's not easy to find it's the um 2002 r's new balances they're so cute like by the way i'm about to go to the video that's really why i'm looking all this crazy so you know not too much on me but y'all can see really look at the quality of the bad box y'all see it look my finger just ripped it that fast but with the real box the good quality ones that would have never happened now next i'm gonna show y'all my jordan fours these are so pretty oh my gosh great quality by the way y'all i'm gonna put the links all that look at it y'all these are so cute like so so good and i've been loving fours lately that's why i chose to get these ones but look at it it's such a pretty shoe like y'all like right like it's so cute like the laces that come with these colors that you want to switch it up let me show you guys the other pair these by the way are from lulu life that are you uh, i'm gonna leave their information you know i'm gonna leave all that down in the description box for y'all if y'all want to go check them out get y'all a pair and honestly this part is like one of my favorites like i love this little jordan thing but yeah these are the shoes y'all look how cute they are they're so freaking cute i believe i got them in a size eight but yum they're so pretty like colorway on these are just like it's like a pastel type of color but it also have some pop of colors like over here in the blue right here but the rest of it is just super pastel super nice like look how cute it is y'all it's so pretty blue life has literally great 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 quality with their shoes y'all and their response time is super fast they have discount codes coupon codes they got everything that you can even imagine Okay. I really love these shoes and I cannot wait to wear them and put an outfit together with them. I mean, I've tried them on, but I haven't, like, you know, put a full blown fit, dripper drown. You know what I'm saying? Next up, the Balenci's. These are slightly too big, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, but they're still cute. Yeah. These are them, the metallic ones, and they have, like, such a pretty color. They're so pretty. Y'all know Balenci's already run kind of big, but I don't know. It's kind of tricky when it comes to the sizes because I've got, I've had some Balenci's before. The pink ones, they were too small. So I tried to size up, but now they're too big. So I'm just like, I don't even know what to do. But anyways, y'all, it's still cute though. I could still rock it even though they're too big, but I would still find a way to, you know, make it work or whatever. It's not like overly big, but it's just slightly too big. Um, These are so cute, so fire, like, and they fit nice too. They're comfortable even when they're too big, but they're still comfortable. They're really pretty sure. Like, I love it. Like, I just wanted a pair of metallic Balenci's and just switch it up because I know I have my pink ones, but I don't know. My pink ones just wasn't really given for real. It was just all pink. I was in like this pink era, but now I'm just like in my bad B, grown B era. You know how to go with these. Of course, I'll be leaving the company's information on the screen and also down in the description box. Look at the bottom, y'all. The bottom is also one of my faves. Like, you don't see no shoe that looks like this. And the quality is literally amazing. Like, it's just such great quality with the shoe. It's so cute. And they, of course, came with some extra laces. Two of them, actually, just for each pair, each shoe. And then, this is the other shoe. It kind of looks slightly different a little bit, but, yo. Yeah. This is it, y'all. It looks kind of big, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. It's like thick shoes, thick laces, and stuff like that. It's a pretty big shoe already for itself. So when you kind of get the wrong size, it does end up looking even bigger. But it's so pretty. Like these ones are. Oh, well, I didn't try because I had tried on the other pair. But y'all see the laces are still on there intact or whatever. Uh, it's such a nice shoe. Like I had seen these online. I think on like Farfetch or something. And I was like, mm, these are so cute. And then it came with this Balenci card, you know, with like all types of information on there. To me this is like so cool like look at it this gives you all types of information on the brand on the shoe all that packaging with balenciaga shoes are also always super nice and then they also have a bag that comes with the shoes this is balenciaga here at the bottom just yeah so if you want to like put the shoes in the bag keep them nice and safe if you want on vacation the box is off too big you want to put them in like you know nice little bag or whatever you can use this you know what I'm saying? Just, just real nice, real, what's the word for it? Real nice, real classy, real just it girl. You see what I'm saying? 
Once again, y'all, I'm going to leave all the information to all these companies down below. It's just about three of them. Um, I'm going to tag them on the screen. Of course, leave their information. Leave their what? Um, leave their contact number. So if you guys want to contact them directly before you order on the site, you're kind of looking for what you want, but you may not see it on the site. Maybe they have it in stock. Maybe you just have to hit them up for it. Maybe you don't see your size. You want to get them custom made. You can do all that, y'all. So I'm just going to leave all the contact numbers down below. As long as their Instagram, their social media, all their information that y'all need. Your website, of course, and also the link to these shoes that I got. If you guys want to get the same ones, you know what I'm saying. But yeah, we'll leave all that information down below for y'all. That's pretty much about it, y'all. I really love all these shoes. Like I have worn the New Balances a couple times. I haven't worn the pores of the Balances yet because I really want to do like a stepping out fit, like who you know, type of fit with this drip or drown. Thank you guys so 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 much for watching. I'm so excited to be back here on YouTube and posting for y'all. I truly hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I know I've been gone for a little while, but y'all, I'm back and I'm better and I'm so excited to be back. Love you guys and thanks again for watching. Mwah.